A Fort Smith man turned away at the polls because he was not wearing a mask, even though face coverings are not required at polling sites in Arkansas. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker tells us what this man has to say about his experience and what the Election Commission says about this mistake. I just wanted to come out, cast my vote, and go home, mind my business. Mark Worsham was back at the Creekmore Park polling site Wednesday for the second time this week after being turned away when trying to early vote on Monday for not wearing a mask, which goes against the governor's mandate. They said I couldn't come in the building unless I was wearing a mask. I had told them, you know, the governor has said masks are not required in polling places. They gave me an excuse about this is city property. They have an ordinance and I can't come in without a mask on. Worsham says he also told the poll worker he had a respiratory issue and couldn't wear a mask and they told him to try another polling site that isn't owned by the city. He left and contacted the governor's office and the Sebastian County Election Commission. It upset me a bit because they're not taking into consideration people's needs. They're just blatantly making a one-size-fits-all type of ruling. The Sebastian County Election Commission says in previous elections, they've always followed the regulations of the buildings where their polling sites are located. And here at Creekmore Park, this building is owned by the city of Fort Smith, where face masks are required to enter the building. Commissioner Lee Webb says this is where the miscommunication happened. That's a first day jitters. You know, we, we train all these people in pretty short notice, a lot of them, and sometimes they just forget what they went through their training on. And it was corrected pretty quickly as soon as we found out about it. Worsham says even though he had to go back a second time to cast his ballot, he's happy the issue is resolved so that other voters like himself won't be turned away. We've been giving up our rights slowly one day at a time, and I'm sick and tired of giving up my rights. Eventually you draw a line in the sand, you say this is where I stand, and this is where I'm standing. In Fort Smith, covering news where you live, Katherine Gilker, 5 News. The Sebastian County Election Commission says at every polling site there are social distancing markers that they ask everybody to follow.